while we learn about the opposition on the pitch, Wiser learns how to heat my home. Steve, obviously a, a lovely day for rugby. Girls had to work hard for it, but a, a good comprehensive scoreline in the end. Yeah, we'd have taken that at the start of the day. I don't think we expected it to be like you said, as comprehensive as that. And at half time, it probably looked like it was going to be uh, almost as tight as the, the league game three or four weeks ago. Um, but, you know, we uh, we were much better second half than we were, than we were for first half. We um, got a little bit more dominance up front. Um, and we were a little bit more clinical with our attack, so uh, you know, the scoreline reflects that. I'll see that the big one from a, a selection side of things was, was Gabby making her first appearance since November, and yeah. really important for her to get just under an hour under under yeah, her belt. Brilliant, and also Brooke coming back off a, a relatively long layoff, and girls coming back in from from international duty. So we did, I, I think it's probably fair to say we did look rusty at times. You know, we weren't massively cohesive. Um, so as I said, to, to, to put that scoreline on the board is is pleasing, but you know, lots of things for us to improve on. Talking about those things to improve on, then a, a tough assignment next week away at Saracens. 14 points out of 15 in the group. It's semi-finals are secured, but an opportunity to go and secure top spot and get a home semi-final. Yeah, it's like every game. We, you know, we know the significance of every game that we go into. We knew the significance of today. We know the significance of next week. Um, obviously, they're sat at the top of, of, the, of the league table. They've obviously gone well in the cup as well. So, um, to me, it's just a, another exciting challenge, one that we'll prepare for as we, as we always do and, and give ourselves the best chance of, of getting a decent result. But, um, you know, we know they'll be strong, it's at their ground, but as I said, it's just, it's just opportunity and excitement from my perspective and I'm sure that'll be echoed by the girls as well. You talk about that opportunity and that excitement, obviously pre-match you're talking about really wanting to be involved with the business end of the season and today was really the start of that now as we look to push on on two fronts. Yeah, are we in the, are we in the semis now? Yeah. yeah okay. so, so yeah, absolutely. We've, um, we, we've qualified for a knockout, but it's really important we take care of, of next week, and we don't we don't see that as a warm up for the knockouts. We see that as a as an isolated game, and we we, we I say we prepare thoroughly, we put the best possible performance we can in because so we did look a bit rusty today. Um, so we need to get those cobwebs out for the knockout stages. Uh, but it's good to know, obviously, we have qualified because it means we get a little bit of continuity because there is potentially a period of time away from playing if you're not in those knockout games so that's uh, that's important brilliant well steve might have been a little bit rusty today but like you said you can't complain with a score like that no absolutely we'll take that all day <laughs>